So, you finally implemented a sales bot. It's working very hard for you 24-7 on every platform your business is present on. Social media, messengers, and of course, your website. But the question is, how can you make sure that your chatbot is set up properly and you're actually getting the most out of it? Well, the answer is metrics. Hello and welcome back to Como, formerly known as Amo CRM. I'm Simon, your guide into the world of chatbot analytics for today. Now, in this video, you will learn about Como's salesbot analytics, why it's crucial for bot implementation, and how you can make it work on our platform. For those that don't know, at Como, we call our chatbot a salesbot. So, salesbot analytics is the real-time data your salesbot generates through its interaction with leads. Unfortunately, not every lead behaves the way you would expect it to. You're dealing with human nature at the end of the day. So to make it easier to evaluate the performance of your sales bot, we provide you with embedded analytic tools with key metrics that you can use to understand what's actually working for your customer and what's not. Now with chatbot analytics and metrics, you can do all sorts of things. For example, you can assess chatbot effectiveness, understand and measure how chatbots contribute to achieving your business objectives. You can simply measure how engaged the customers get with chatbot conversations, for example, and if the chatbot is affecting their answers or actions. Now that way, you can track the bot's effectiveness and identify if any areas need further improvements. Salesbot analytics can also help you understand how satisfied the customers are with your chatbot. Does your chatbot positively impact your customer experience and stimulate recurring conversations? If you don't know, now is a good time to find out. By using Salesbot Analytics, you can understand to what extent your chatbot is able to provide your customers with the information that they're looking for and how it affects their retention rate. With the help of metrics, you will also be able to measure business ROI. Now, ROI stands for Return on Investment, and it measures how much you paid for an investment to how much you've earned from it. Basically, it shows how profitable your investment is. Most business owners who have implemented chatbots into their business agree that they deliver significant ROI with minimal effort. So what I'm trying to say here is that Salesbot Analytics is as an essential as a Salesbot itself. With a constant feedback loop, you can find areas of improvement that will help your business become even more successful. Let me show you how it all works in action. To start tracking the Salesbot metrics in your Como account, proceed to Settings, then Communication Tools, and go to Salesbot section. Scroll down, and here we can see the conversion rates for all the Salesbot we've created, the total launches, and the number of active sessions. Let me go into each metric in more detail here. The conversion rate shows the percentage of people who've completed the defined action. The criteria for conversion varies by chatbot use case. In many cases, conversion counts when the lead indicates their name, phone number, or email address to the chatbot. If your chatbot is effective, it will be reflected in a high conversion rate. Total launched shows the total number of salesbot launches. For example, how many conversations with the leads it's held. It's one of the primary metrics you should track in Como, as it helps you capture insights on how many customers are using your chatbot. Active sessions are ongoing conversations of the chatbot with the lead. These conversations haven't yet been closed. All right, ready to get your hands dirty? Let's open one of the sales bots in our visual builder to get more insights. Now that's our good old bot that we've been using on our Telegram. It's been set up to greet our potential leads and provide them with basic information about our products and promotions. Now, meanwhile, it also tracks the client's behavior by default and neatly saves it in the analytical report. And here's how the bot script looks like in Como. Above each sales bot message, we can see some of the performance metrics. Every step in sales bot has its own metric. All steps, however, have launches that show how many times this step was launched and its conversion rate. These stats apply to all such steps be it a message, an action, a pause, or something else. Some of the salesbot steps, for example, action or validation, will have only this one metric. Let's click on one of the stats to see the full report. Each message in the salesbot shows values for the number of times it was sent and read. That's pretty straightforward. Sent represents how many times this message has been sent to users. Read means how many users have read the message. Now, if the salesbot message has buttons, you will also see the clicked metrics, which show the number of users who clicked on any of the buttons inside your message. If you have a pause in the salesbot script, the off timer resumes shows the number of times the bot has resumed before the configured pause time has passed. 
This can happen, for example, if you manually resume the bot from the lead card. An important thing to note is that you will only start seeing SalesBot analytics once the bot starts interacting with the lead. It kind of makes sense. Now, I don't know about you, but I'm curious to check the analytics for the last message of our SalesBot script. So what we can see here is that only a very small percentage of leads reach the very end of our SalesBot. That's a little bit disappointing, but at least the metrics helped us realize that our SalesBot needs some changes and some improvements, as well as where things went wrong. These numbers help you clearly understand which sales bot are successful, require some tweaking, or can be permanently deleted. Moreover, analytics in Como help you discover the weak spots for each of the sales bots you're using, so you'll know exactly what needs to be fixed. As you can see, chatbot analytics in Como provide valuable information about your sales bot conversations. You can use this knowledge to drive better customer satisfaction. A simple change can bring about significant results. To learn more about Como's sales bot, go to the description below. And if you've enjoyed this video, please give it a like. Thank you for watching. See you next time.